What about the the prison breakout? How did how because it was successful apparently. Yeah. Tell me about that. Karim, yeah, the Algerian, the ghost. He was a cocaine dealer. He had contacts all over Portugal, Algeria, and he worked in the little shop. It was at the corner, the corner of the jail, next to the big wall. And uh, he said to me, a few weeks we got talking, he went, listen, yeah, I'm going to do a nine, yeah? He went, you're going to get a nine as well, yeah? He went, listen, let's just both go, okay? And he told me the story, yeah? He's going to dig a hole. There was a refrigerator. He showed me the hole he was digging. <laughs> he was digging it slowly with a spoon, yeah? Short shank with that. This is, yeah. <laughs> I know you love me, but it's true, yeah? He was digging it with a fucking spoon, yeah? And uh, I was uh, looking at the hole, and then I looked at the wall. He went, it's just this wall. Once we go through this, we just need to run down, avoid getting shot off the screw, <laughs> avoid getting shot off the screw from the top. And then once we're at the other wall, we could hop that one. And I got my car waiting. I was thinking, I don't know, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking, I don't know, yeah? I went, listen, I said, I'll cover your ass, yeah? Mm -hmm. I said, I'll cover your fucking ass, yeah? Okay? I know, right, okay, fair enough. There was a German dude as well at the time. He didn't want a part of it because his brother was in as well. And he didn't want to escape without taking his br brother so carrying me was on his own anyway he used to bang he used to bang on this fucking uh, bang on this wall yeah my cell directly opposite so I used to play my music on my radio loud and purpose yeah so the screws they couldn't hear anyway he was banging 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 boom boom boom, boom. and then um, the day they escaped he went right listen the hole's done he had like a fridge what well, wasn't working covered the hole it was like um, you know this, 60s <laughs> style jail <laughs> really yeah if you think about it yeah how he did it yeah it was so good how he did it anyway he took the fucking hole he took the fucking hole he showed me the hole anyway you want to come I went no I went no anyway he was allowed to stay in the shop at the corner to do the stock take an hour after everybody else so we were all in association at the time yeah we were association from 6 to 7 o'clock and so he says he's going to do the breakout in that time, yeah? And so he told me to stage a fight, yeah? Stage a fight so all the screws land and they're all on my bit and so he can do a run for it. I went, right, okay. So he staged it, yeah? Half seven, I think it was the time, yeah? Half six or half seven, one of the two. Anyway, we synchronised the watches, yeah? I mean, the German, I mean, all right. And then we started an argument over... Um, TV, there was a shitty little fucking TV cord in fucking metal and plastic. You couldn't even see the fucking screen, yeah? <laughs> and then we were arguing over what to watch. So I argued with him and this and that. So I threw a chair at him. Plastic chair, he threw one back. And so we just started a fight, yeah? We started a fight and then boom, the whistles rang out and then all the screws rang. Exactly in half, six, half, seven, I don't exactly time, yeah? Anyway. Karim, done one, boom, he was away. He was away. And at a time, then we heard some shots, bam, bam, bam. And they were right, escape. And then the screws just fucking turned around. Back heel, boom, right? They back heeled and they were gone. Anyway, five minutes later, they come back and they were right. Everybody lock up, bang up. Yeah, we thought, right. And I went, what's happened? Has he gone away or what? Screws and say a word, yeah. We knew he got away, yeah. I was in mixed feelings at the time, yeah. Thinking I should have fucking gone with him, you know. Yeah. And uh, as he still did, they ever get caught? He got caught again. He got grassed up. He he went to Portugal. Mm -hmm. He sent me a postcard. <laughs> signed the ghost. <laughs> signed the ghost. Yeah. Because that's what he called himself, the ghost. Yeah. He sent me a postcard. The ghost. He went. Take care, chat. Nice one, brother. Blah blah blah. The ghost. Anyway, he come back to Spain. To collect a debt, collect a, you know a debt. Why debt. come back to he Spain? He got grassed up. He got grassed up, and that was. Fucking... Why come back to Spain though? The place you just know, fucking left. Dollar. He was all dollar there. Yeah. Thirty or grand. So what did they get? How much more did get put on his sentence? He'll do that and then get more for the escape. Is he still yeah. in? Yeah. Is he still in? No, no, no. This was back in 1990, 1999. He'll be out now. 
Do you, do you, but that might be even dead, yeah. Know? Do you, no, do you not contact anymore? No, no, no. Do you, part of you miss not doing that escape for the buzz? No, I don't want to get shot, man. <laughs> <laughs> Would you fit him through the hole? How big was the hole? Well, you know what? You're bald, you know? He was a little skinny kid, you know? I'm quite big. Yeah. You know, I'm easy to shoot. You're easy to shoot. <laughs> That's fucking I'm easy madness. to shoot, you know? <laughs>